Hi folks, it's Max from uh, GalaxyNote2.com. So I've got a quick ROM overview of the latest MyROM uh, custom ROM here. And uh, this is running the latest uh, MB4, which also has uh, 4G LT enabled. So if you live in uh, any of the 4G LT uh, areas, it's actually launching tomorrow, uh, March 26th. Uh, so if you live in those areas, um, you might want to get a custom ROM, or you can also update to a ROM that supports um, the LTE, just a stock ROM. I'll also post a rooted version of that you can install if you want to stay stock. Uh, but this ROM is one of the first, my ROM is one of the first ROMs that's supporting LTE with the latest firmware, based on the latest firmware. Uh, as you can see, I've got, I think this is 5x6 or 5x5 TouchWiz launcher, uh, which is really nice. And uh, the T-Mobile hotspot, native hotspot doesn't work, uh, but Wi-Fi Tether uh, app works just fine. I'm using the Trev E mod. Um, you can find a full tutorial I did on uh, the Verizon Galaxy Note 2 on my site galaxynote2.com, and it's the exact same process, and it will allow you to tether just fine. Um, so do that if you need tethering. And also, let me show you around. Um, the coolest part about this ROM, you see all the different colors there. Um, that's from all the different colors I uh, swapped out here. You can change the status bar here. Uh, let's, it's like a yellow, and you can change the alpha. This is like, you know, a kind of a see-through. If you go all the way, it's just going to be green. Uh, if you want to kind of see-through, you can do that. And uh, some of the stuff, you might have to reboot to actually see the changes. Uh, but some of the stuff, you won't have to reboot. Uh, let me try the clock color. Yeah, I think this one, the clock actually changes instantly. So let me try a dark green color. Ooh, it's not changing. Um, and uh, AM PM style, you can actually, there you go. No, you can't see it that well there. I'll show you there. But you can pretty much customize everything on this ROM. There you go, now you can see it. Uh, you will see it a little bit later. Uh, if you don't want to show the day of the week, you can also do that. But you can pretty much swap out all of these colors, customize it, which is kind of neat. And just go ahead and reboot if it doesn't make changes. Um, after a reboot, it will make the changes. And also, multi-window control for those of you who need uh, multi-window enable for all apps. Simply add any apps you want there. And uh, that should be all good to go for those of you who want to use multi-window. ROM toolbox uh, is included here. And uh, this is just a file manager there. Um, Samsung secret codes, faster GPS fix if you have trouble with GPS, and also a bunch of boot animations you can change easily here. Uh, so very nice. Actually, let's try one. Let's try the BIOS. BIOS. Install it, and let's go ahead and reboot and see if the color change actually took effect here. And you can do a hot reboot, um, so boot faster. And let's see if that will actually show the animation here. Um, there we go. Um, actually, you know what? I'm not sure if the latest version actually supports Boo animation. Uh, there you go. So you see the change there, uh, status bar. I actually don't like that color, so I might change it back. Uh, but there's a bunch of ways you can kind of uh, play with those colors. And uh, let me show you also the lock screen options. Um, where is it? Lock screen. There we go. And lock screen options. Uh, you get the standard ink ink effects. Um, wake up in lock screen if you want. And let me go ahead and show you the the Maui um, launcher. My launcher. It's pretty awesome. You can have two launchers, and you can get a bunch of free themes, which is really nice. Um, where's application manager? And simply go find all here and go to uh, my home and you'll be able to uh, cancel it. So that's the the MyUI launcher and also my ROM home this is the TouchWiz launcher. So go ahead and clear defaults uh, hit the home button you'll be able to switch to the MyUI launcher or the My Home launcher and there we go so I've got a new launch this is a completely MyUI launcher the good thing with this one is that you can swap out themes very easily. A uh, bunch of free themes you can get. 
So let's try DJ Max here. So there you go. Boom. And you can get more themes uh, online here. These are all Mayui themes. So you don't have to be running. The beauty of this ROM is that you don't have to be running a my actual Mayui ROM, uh, which is kind of not that you know updated that often. But this way you can you know run the latest T-Mobile uh, firmware along with the my Mayui themes, Mayui launcher, and also you can go back to um, your launcher, your favorite launcher. Uh, yeah, but looking very nice. I mean, also you can swap out the colors for your um, for your quick toggles there. But I'm going to switch it back. Um, and let me go ahead and switch it back. Just go find my home, and uh, that's my home. Clear defaults, and you can go back to the other launcher here. Um, very nice ROM. If you want to be on the latest. A T-Mobile uh, official firmware that supports 4G LTE plus, uh, you know, modify launcher and this launcher and all these customizations. Definitely check this one out. My my ROM has always been on top of my list for one of the best ROMs for T-Mobile Galaxy Note 2. It should be very stable. Also, um, should give you give you pretty good battery life. Uh, however, there's no overclocking on this one. You can install a overclockable kernel such as bullet kernel if you want for the T-Mobile Note 2. Anyway, check it out for this week's ROM of the week. Uh, if you want to stay rooted, if you want to be on a custom ROM, this is one of the earlier ROMs that's available right now with the latest 4G LTE official firmware. So you can receive 4G LTE uh, if you live in one of those cities. And uh, yeah, do let me know what you think. And also I'll have a video up soon on the rooted official um, stock version of the 4G LTE official firmware also. Uh, for those of you who want to run completely stock. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching this video. If you have a T-Mobile Galaxy Note 2, any of the Galaxy Note 2s, um, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxynote2root.com. We update you once a week with Romulo Week tips, hacks, and more. And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button down there. If you have, thanks a lot. Uh, and stay high on Android. I'll see you guys later.